probably head to Haydock um, for one of his first outings. Um, we see him a bit more this year because injury held us up until after Christmas last year. But um, yes, we've probably had uh, Haydock and then if he won that, there's still the million pound bonus. So that would tempt us into going to the King George. And then a spring campaign with a, with a Gold Cup being a main target. Well, he's been very well and uh, all being well, we hope to turn up at the, the Betfair at Haydock. Mm -hmm. The ground is okay and the horse is fine. Yeah. That's, that's plan A anyway. Yeah. And then we sort of take the season from there, you know, mm -hmm. we go one race at a time. But, uh, and is the million pounds something that's, oh, I'm sure it's very tempting. Well, I think it'll a lot will depend on uh, what happens in the, on the first leg. Yes, of course. <laughs> if it, you know, if, uh, if we are lucky enough to win it, will it then it would be tempting to uh, mm -hmm. win go for the million pound. But uh, the gold cup at the end of the day is the, is the main aim again. Yeah. Hopefully. So, uh, and on that day, how special was it? And has it quite sunk in yet? Yeah. Oh, it, it was a little bit surreal, really. It sort of dream sort of come true you don't really take a bit of sinking in and even now when we keep watching the watching the dvd we sort of suddenly think oh, this is the gold cup you know we've <laughs> achieved our goal so yeah uh, you know it's just a you know really uh, fantastic feeling and never thought we'd ever sort of achieve it i have one who actually good enough to run in the race and last year even the year before he was third we mm. we've uh, you know, that's really done really well, so it's an absolute bonus.